The Santiago Bernabeu Stadium witnessed a night of contrasting emotions as Real Madrid secured a resounding 4-0 victory against Osasuna in La Liga. Vinicius Jr. stole the show with a magnificent hat-trick, his first for the club, illuminating a night that was otherwise shrouded in concern due to injuries sustained by key players. The Brazilian's virtuoso performance provided a much-needed boost for Los Blancos, who were desperate for a win following recent setbacks. The victory, however, came at a cost. Eder Militao, Rodrigo and Lucas Vasquez were all forced off the pitch due to injuries, adding to Real Madrid's growing list of absentees. The sight of key players leaving the field with knocks cast a shadow over the celebrations, leaving Carlo Ancelotti with a selection headache ahead of crucial upcoming fixtures. Despite the emphatic scoreline, the match was not without its nervy moments. Osasuna proved to be stubborn opponents, frustrating Real Madrid's attack for large periods of the game. It took a moment of individual brilliance from Vinicius to break the deadlock, setting the stage for a memorable night for the young Brazilian. Vinicius Jr. was undoubtedly the star of the show, putting on a masterclass in attacking football. His first goal was a testament to his blistering pace and composure as he latched onto a through ball and calmly slotted it past the on-rushing goalkeeper. The second goal showcased his dribbling skills and vision as he weaved through the Osasuna defence before unleashing an unstoppable shot into the back of the net. The hat-trick was completed in the dying minutes of the game with Vinicius once again demonstrating his predatory instincts to pounce on a loose ball in the box. This was a performance that underlined his growing importance to the team and his ability to single-handedly decide matches at the highest level. Beyond the goals, Vinicius was a constant threat to the Osasuna defence, tormenting them with his pace, trickery and direct running. He was at the heart of almost every attacking move for Real Madrid, linking up effectively with his teammates and creating numerous scoring opportunities. The euphoria of Vinicius Jr.'s hat-trick was tempered by the sight of three key players leaving the field injured. Eda Militao was the first to succumb, clutching his hamstring in the first half and signalling to the bench that he was unable to continue. The Brazilian defender's injury is a particular concern for Ancelotti, as he has been one of Real Madrid's most consistent performers this season. Rodrigo's evening ended prematurely in the second half when he appeared to pull up with a muscle injury after a sprint. The young Brazilian has been in scintillating form this season, and his absence, even if for a short period, will be a significant blow to Real Madrid's attacking threat. Lucas Vasquez, who has deputised admirably in various positions this season, was the third player to be withdrawn due to injury. The Spaniard seemed to have picked up a knock and was replaced with minutes left on the clock. While the extent of Vasquez's injury is yet to be determined, his absence adds to Ancelotti's selection worries. Speaking after the game, Carlo Ancelotti was full of praise for Vinicius Jr.'s performance, hailing his exceptional quality and match-winning ability. The Italian manager acknowledged the importance of the Brazilian's goals, particularly in the context of the team's recent struggles. Vinicius was the difference tonight, Ancelotti stated. He took his goals brilliantly and showed his quality on the big stage. However, Ancelotti could not hide his concern about the injuries picked up by his players. We are waiting for news on the injuries to Militao, Rodrigo and Lucas, he said. We hope it is nothing serious, but we will have to wait for the medical assessments. The Italian manager admitted that the injuries had taken some of the gloss off the victory and that he would have preferred to have secured the three points without any casualties. Section 5. 
Real Madrid's response to adversity. The victory against Osasuna was crucial for Real Madrid, who went into the match on the back of two consecutive defeats in all competitions. The losses against RB Leipzig in the Champions League and Girona in La Liga had piled the pressure on Ancelotti's men, and there was a sense of relief around the Bernabeu as the team got back to winning ways. The win moved Real Madrid back to the top of La Liga, albeit potentially temporarily, depending on the outcome of Barcelona's match. However, the performance, particularly in the first half, highlighted that there are still areas for improvement. Despite dominating possession, Real Madrid struggled to break down a well-organized Osasuna defense and were reliant on moments of individual brilliance from Vinicius to make the breakthrough. Section 6. The Catalan shadow looms large. Real Madrid's victory over Osasuna came just hours before Barcelona's match against their opponents. The pressure is firmly back on Xavi's side, who know that anything less than a win could see them fall further behind their arch-rivals in the La Liga title race. The contrasting fortunes of the two Spanish giants have been one of the main talking points of the season so far. While Real Madrid have been their usual consistent selves, Barcelona have struggled for consistency, particularly in the Champions League, where they face an uphill battle to qualify for the knockout stages. Section 7 a moment of solidarity and remembrance. Before kickoff, the Bernabeu observed a minute's silence in memory of the victims of the recent floods that devastated parts of Spain. The gesture was a poignant reminder of the suffering caused by the natural disaster and the importance of unity and solidarity in the face of adversity. Real Madrid also announced that they would be making a significant donation to the relief efforts, demonstrating their commitment to supporting the affected communities. The club's actions were widely praised, highlighting the important role that football clubs can play in times of crisis. Section 8. The road ahead for Los Blancos. The victory over Osasuna will give Real Madrid a much needed confidence boost as they head into a crucial period of the season. Los Blancos face a challenging run of fixtures in the coming weeks, including a Champions League clash against their next opponents and a La Liga showdown against Atletico Madrid. Ancelotti will be hoping that the injuries picked up by Militao, Rodrigo and Vasquez are not as serious as initially feared. The Italian manager will need all his experience and tactical news to navigate his team through the upcoming challenges and keep their title aspirations on track. Section 9. The unstoppable rise of Vinicius Jr. Vinicius Jr.'s hat-trick against Osasuna was a further demonstration of his remarkable development over the past year. The Brazilian has established himself as one of the most exciting young talents in world football and a key player for Real Madrid. His pace, dribbling skills and eye for goal make him a nightmare for defenders. And his work rate and commitment to the team have also impressed. If he can continue his current trajectory, there is no doubt that Vinicius Jr. has the potential to become one of the best players in the world.